Hi everyone, I'm JD from Willow Bound Journals. Welcome back to my channel. So this is a new journal that I have made and I love it so much. It is a pink and purple floral journal, soft cover fabric journal cover. And I've just used this beautiful fabric that I found at the op shop with the beautiful pinks and purples. And then I was umming and ahhing over if I should add this doily or not. And in the end, I really like how it looks. I'm trying to get more into collaging and layering this year, stepping out of my comfort zone um, and doing some more covers with more fabrics and trims and collaging. So I'm starting slow and just putting one piece on at a time. So hopefully by the end of the year, you'll start to see covers <laughs> that have a lot more going on. Um, but for now, just keeping it simple. And I did purple eyelets and purple sari silk, no, seam binding, closure. And then pink uh, embroidery thread for the binding. So that brings out both the pink and the purple. We've got some charms. First of all, there's a stamp tag with a vintage stamp. We've got this purple charm here or bead. And then we've got a pink bird and a pink and clear crystal beaded charm as well. So let's go in and open this up. I do have a tutorial coming up as well on how I make these covers. Um, so that shall be fun. I have got another cover like this that I made. And I just put some wide lace down the spine of this journal and it is a pocket if you want it to be but then in the pages I've got a whole bunch of botanicals florals garden type pages it, it is embellished as well so we have beautiful note paper here with the rose and over here we've got an envelope so pretty and like a, there's writing space on it and there is a card in there and we've got some tracing paper this one i love as well because there's writing space with decoration already on the page doily and i've got a mix of purple and pink pages in this journal flips and flaps i've got one of my wallpaper pockets um paper clipped in here with some tags from paper daisy journals and a paint chip crystal rose this is this gorgeous textured paper and a vintage swap card we've got an envelope page with gold envelopes and a journal card in there and flips there um, a little note card there one of my original music paper tags that i love making with vintage music paper this one is also textured paper it's heavier weight uh, feels more like parchment paper and i just decorated some of these beautiful pages with some washi tape this, this comes from washi wednesday all right i'm gonna <laughs> try not to go through every single pocket and piece uh, but this one is special this one feels like japanese kind of rice paper so smooth on this side but textured on this side really really pretty i'm trying to branch out with my types of papers too um, and add to my collection of different types made a large pocket here and there's a vintage postcard in there and this is oh, just such a beautiful page okay there's just too much to look at but we're going to be here forever it is a three signature journal um, so there's lots of pages one of my fabric and lace envelopes this is one of my favorite pieces there's a vintage tea card tag in there and i made this pocket out of music paper and some decorative paper at the bottom love that piece another one of my wallpaper tags this is a vintage library card so yeah, three signatures, lots and lots of pages in each signature, lots of embellishments and just fun bits and pieces. So I'll just try to go a bit quicker so we're not here forever. <laughs> but yeah, just really fun. I like this new addition too. There is a pocket behind there. Um, adding a glassine bag or envelope onto a page that doesn't have much detail on it or isn't pretty to look at this is just writing so I like decorating it like that rather than sticking a whole other book page on top just a stamped card there that I did with one of my stamps large 
Children's Index Card Pocket Thingy. <laughs> Glassine bag here. Love the sound that makes. Another tag in here. This lace pocket. Vintage dictionary, illustrated dictionary. Another wallpaper pocket, note paper. <laughs> it just goes on and on and on. These, these journals are quite large. Uh, one of my envelopes that I decorated using vintage paper and stickers and other vintage papers there. Really, really fun to create those. I should do more. <laughs> Another fold out page. Really fun. I got on a roll with this type of journal, so I do have three others that I will be sharing with you. Um, oh, that one's paper put on. This is a vintage bridge card. I love this pocket here. Oh, and look, you can see the thing that's behind it. <laughs> oh, I love this page. This one is one of my wallpaper pockets on music paper. And there's another music paper tag inside. I love the different tones of the music paper too. Uh, one of my embellished glassine bags. Love it. There's a tag in there. Press card behind it. That's one of my favourites as well, actually. And a beautiful fabric cluster. <laughs> uh, so yeah, this one is already sold. Um, thank you so much. Oh, I love this one too. This is a um, embellished coin envelope. So really fun to finally be using those. I made a whole bunch last year and didn't really use them because I just hoard things. <laughs> but this is the year where I'm using them. Another pocket here. I love this napkin. I'm using the uh, decorative napkin to make a double pocket. This is an envelope pocket. This is a vintage greeting card or it's actually for a 21st with the key. I love this one here. Oh my goodness, so pretty. And there's pieces in there and there's a pocket behind as well. So, so pretty. Oh my goodness, I love that one. <laughs> That's such a cool page. Um, this one has a card in there. And I put this because it says purple to go with the purple theme. And there's a pocket there with another postcard. And there is the back, gorgeous illustration here. There's a pocket and there is the back of the journal and love 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 it <laughs> really fun um to make and i hope you enjoyed that flip through and let me know what you think in the comments and i'll see you guys in the next video bye guys